Hello everyone, welcome to the Snow Thunder Morecast, where you can stay up to date with all the latest happenings going on in the world of Snow Thunder. So this past week uh, was kind of crazy with midterms and everything, um, but before that I had a little bit of time to myself um, with fall break and everything and just got to kind of lie around, be lazy, and uh, kind of recuperate from what's been going on with everything. Um, unfortunately in that time, the castle crashers that in the last Morecast I had talked about with Will and any of the other guys has not happened. Um, we then, once everybody got back, I guess we got really busy. Um, so that's hopefully something we're actually looking forward to doing this weekend, depending upon everybody's schedules. Um, I think some people might actually even be going home this weekend with their parents, seeing as how it's homecoming, so there might be some... Anyways, regardless, that's... I did do um, some more Absolver videos even before this, um, which Michael has not actually been able to edit or upload, which I'm going to call him out on that, uh, but that's okay because he did a really good job on the last Morecast and I was really happy with how it turned out even though we're still, uh, <laughs> it's still pretty rough, uh, but that's okay, we're getting, we'll get the hang of it eventually, eventually it'll actually look good too, it'll be kind of standardized and it won't be super wonky, regardless. The big thing that I want to talk about in this Morecast is Warframe, actually. They... it was within the last week, last, uh... it was five days ago, I believe? Um, they actually released this huge update, the Plains of, um... El... Eldeon... Eldeon... Anyways, it was a really big update, really big cool update, and, um... I had been actually playing Warframe for a couple days before that, so that was leading up to it, and I think I probably got back into it like right at the perfect time, because I was uh, kind of like grinding away and getting farther up into the in the actual main storyline. When while um, everybody was anticipating this big update that I really had very little idea about, and then I log in one day, and everybody's freaking out about it. They're all asking how we can get to the planes and stuff, and I'm like, wow, huh? So I go and check it out, and it was it was really cool. It was a big open expanse where you can uh, slide and jump and go really fast all over the place, I guess. And then you can kill birds with their feathers. Yeah. So specifically, Warframe, um, Snow Thunder does have a dojo or a, a clan um, in Warframe, and we are absolutely recruiting for that. Um, and especially since, I mean, there's other games that I'll be playing soon. I've been kind of enthralled with Warframe lately. But if, especially if you kind of want to uh, earn some real quick PR with uh, Snow Thunder and even probably end up uh, being like management or something for the, the dojo while I'm away, um, this is your opportunity to get in on it because depending on when I finally stop playing Warframe like every single day for like at least a little bit just to log in and check up on my my crafting and everything and keep the uh, the dojo expanding um, eventually I'll just be checking in like less and less time and I'd love to have a lot of uh, a bigger base of people in the the dojo with me um, That'd be really cool, especially if I got Michael. I don't know if he plays it on PC. I know he played it on Xbox. Um, I should get him to play it on PC. But I mean, I really enjoy like the combat system in Warframe, and I would think it's a really good um, game in general. And so I'm glad that there's kind of this uh, this re reboot going on. Not really, I guess, not as much as a reboot, but um, people are kind of being drawn into it more, even though the the planes aren't really the place for new players to go like you can get access to it relatively early it's in one of the the lower tier planets but there's not a ton for new players to do i guess because once you get there you just kind of have to grind away at everything on the planet to make to get materials for the stuff on the planet but there's like the um the uh arc wing you don't even have an arc ring to craft to be able to craft the the launcher for it 
when you're on the planet. And the Ark Waiting Quest is quite a few down. I mean, I just, when I started playing again, I mean, about two weeks ago, um, I had just, I just then got the Ark Wing, and that was, that's not even that far in the, the main quest line. I guess, I just kind of didn't know what I was doing, and that's something I kind of almost appreciate for Warframe, because you just have to figure things out and or just get help from people that are more experienced um and so you have to just kind of discover the universe and figure things out or just go to the wiki and scroll through the wiki for hours <laughs> um but anyways the point i want to make is that um warframe is definitely something that i would like to open up to everybody um and suggest that if you don't have a, a guild or a, a clan, to definitely look into joining Snow Thunder. Um, it'd be great to actually have that kind of uh, perpetuating uh, clan. I guess there's other games that we can do this with as well. I mean, Warframe's just currently the, the big one um, in my head right now. And so, of course, if you want to join in, uh, get in contact with me through uh, either um, Warframe itself, I don't know how exactly I need to look into that. Or of course sending us an email, contact at snowthunder.net, and we'll get you in touch with the right people, and by right people I mean me, and we'll, uh, we'll get you set up, and uh, the more people we get in, the, the better off we probably will be. Anyways, I've been ranting for about Warframe for a while. Good game, love it, like it, enjoy it. Definitely look into joining Snow Thunder's clan on Warframe. Looking toward the future, um, things that I am looking forward to. Uh, the Jigsaw movie coming out next weekend for Halloween weekend. I'm actually pretty excited for that. Um, I'm a, a decent fan of the series and uh, I'm, I'm definitely looking forward to seeing the new movie. I don't think I'll be able to see it opening night though. I think uh, we have a cross-country meet, but that's okay. Um, it's been a, it's been a while since they made a movie, another movie. But this is like a reboot type thing, so we'll see how it goes. It, the all the ad the ads and stuff for it they look interesting enough, so eh, it's a saw movie. No, I'm intrigued by by those types of movies. I'm not actually into murder porn. There's there's a different like there, there's a there's a they're really close to each other. Like the 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 weird like psychotic like mind weird game movies the intriguing factor of saw and then like the the, the gore and the guts and the murder porn there's the, 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 okay anyways that's it's a whole nother subject um <laughs> and then of course for the whole halloween season there's definitely the chance that we'll do some uh spooky shenanigans depends on whether or not stuff gets on camera um maybe even get in contact with the guys i mean if we can even just BS with each other over a chat and some uh, some TF2 because the Halloween TF2 will be in full swing. Um, but anyways, that's kind of a, a long-winded thing. Main point of this Morecast, Warframe. It's cool. It's hip. You should play it with us. Um, me, Snow Thunder. Anyways, look for more details on that uh, on our website, snowthunder.net. And be sure to reach out to us in any of the other social media and um, keep up to date. Uh, watch the Morecast every week and definitely watch out for any other special updates or, and of course all of our, our main videos. Um, so I'm Jared, this is Snow Thunder, the Snow Thunder Morecast. Stay classy, stay in character, and remember to always pinch before you sprinkle. Have a nice day.